Hi folks, uh, this is Dr. Alp Sivas. I'm the Carb Addiction Doc, and we, today we're going to talk about this massively complex, very emotional topic called celiac disease. Celiac disease. And it is this massive profit center from people that are so good at leading you by your nose ring down a misguided pathway. Celiac disease is very, very simple. Let me break it down for you. Celiac disease is inflammation of the intestine and via the intestine, potentially the rest of the body, that is triggered by, triggered by gluten and gliadin, which are proteins that are found in grain products. Simple. Okay? Now, here's the second thing you need to know. No mammal... No mammal tolerates gluten. When you grain feed a cow, when you feed vegetarian animals or omnivorous animals, your dog, me, carnivores, grain products, they all, every mammal, has a degree of inflammation that occurs in the intestine as a direct consequence to the inflammatory response against gluten and the gliadin proteins, the grain proteins. That's how these products, that's how these seeds and foods protected themselves from being overeaten. That's how plants protect. They can't run away. So celiac disease is the clinical evidence, the symptomatic clinical evidence of the disease triggered in an autoimmune or an immunologic, not autoimmune, in an immunologic response to these proteins that no human beings, no mammals can tolerate. Everybody gets inflammation. Sometimes that inflammation is so subtle and so low level, you don't notice it. Sometimes the inflammation is awful that with, if you walk within six feet of a beer that contains uh, uh, gluten, you break out in this horrible, horrible overreaction in your gut. That's related to your percentage of sensitivity, but everybody is sensitive. So now, oh my God, celiac disease, gluten, blah, blah, blah. blah. Let's make all these gluten-free products. Well, all the gluten-free products are carbohydrates minus the gluten. And that stuff tastes like cardboard. It tastes awful, but it's gluten-free. How illogical is that? And how duped have you not been as a society? Because the simple answer to gluten for everybody and the simplest, healthiest way to live anyway is carbohydrate-free. So if you're on a carbohydrate-free diet, none of that gluten celiac industry matters. It's irrelevant. There's no gluten in other vegetables. There's no gluten in in, uh, animal products. If you're carbohydrate-free, you're automatically gluten-free. You don't have to worry. You don't have to spend ridiculous amounts of money on bits of cardboard. Gluten-free bread, gluten-free pizza, gluten-free ice cream, gluten-free beer. Drink a damn glass of wine. Eat vegetables. Eat animal products. You don't pay a penny to be gluten-free if you are carbohydrate-free. In fact, quite frankly, the opposite is true. It's a massive investment in your life, in your health, and the return of that investment is going to be measured both in terms of health, happiness, and dollars when you are gluten-free. But gluten-free by being carb-free. It's not a difficult thing to understand, folks. Don't cling on to all the crap that people sell and people pitch to make money from you. If you're symptomatic from gluten or gliadin or the gluten products, go carb-free. Go carb-free. It's a massive benefit. It's not going to be that difficult to do relative to being gluten-free. Simple to understand, folks. It's not difficult. Not difficult to understand at all. And the level of your intestinal immunity is radically reduced. And remember that gluten is one of the triggers, one of the largest triggers of autoimmune disease. 
Your immune system reacts against gluten, which is a foreign invader. But that same ramped up immune system can now act against yourself when it sees it in a foreign way. Hashimoto's, for example, is likely, tr likely triggered by the same pathway as an autoimmune response. And that is why an ultra low carbohydrate, gluten free diet, carbohydrate free diet, is so effective in treating Hashimoto's to remission. So think that through, folks. Are you, because of your diet, the cause of your own symptoms? And by going on a low-carbohydrate, high-fat diet, particularly leaning more carnivore, you may lose weight, you will lose weight, you will become healthier, and maybe you will be symptom-free without having to panic about where you get your, your gluten-free crap from. I hope you've had an aha moment I hope you've understand, understood this very simplistically because it's made very complex by the people that are trying to pitch and sell you stuff. Stay carb-free, my friends. I am the Carb Addiction Doc. If you want to consult, if you have some of these issues and you want to see where you stand, give us a shout. Text us, WhatsApp us, uh, uh, call us, 561-517-0642. I am a practicing clinical doctor. So I will approach this from a blood work and a medical perspective that other folks may not be able to do because they don't have that or the experience to deal with it. I hope this has helped. Think it through. Leave some comments down below. Read the show notes because there's a lot of information on the show notes. And if you like my content, hit the subscribe button. It helps me to keep this free. Till next time.